Chapter 3-2 Comparing and Ordering Decimals In today's lesson, we're going to learn some strategies so that we can learn how to correctly compare numbers that have decimals. In comparing, we're either going to use the sign greater than, less than, or equal. Let's begin. We're going to start with 5.67 and 5.72. If you look at the bottom, what I've done is I've aligned the numbers by the decimal. And I've done this so that I can compare the numbers column by column until I can find where they're different. The first column, they both had a 5. But in the second column, one was a 6 and the other had a 7. Since 7 is greater, that means that whole number is greater. The larger number is 5.72. The next example shows 0.293 and 0.253. Again, I align the numbers based on the decimal, and then I start comparing column by column. The first column is the same. The second column is the same, but the third column I've put a rectangle around, I have a 9 and a 5. A 9 is greater than a 5. That means the number that contains the 9 is bigger. 0.293 is larger or greater than 0.253. The more difficult task would be ordering decimals. This is difficult because now we have around 4 numbers to rank and order instead of 2. In this case, we have to order 15, 14.95, 15.8, and 15.01 from least to greatest. The first thing that I would do is align the numbers by the decimal. You can see that I've started that at the bottom, but I've also done something else. I have taken all blank spaces and filled them with zeros. This allows me to get a clearer view of how to compare the numbers. The next task is going column by column and comparing the numbers. Now, I can look at which one is the largest as well as which one is the smallest. This helps me rank. As a result, I have now correctly ranked the numbers. The smallest number is 14.95. It is followed by 15, then 15.01, and finally by 15.80. This has been Chapter 3-2, Comparing and Ordering Decimals. If you have any questions, please contact me through email or visit me on my website. Thanks a lot and have a great day.